Oh, you been there. What do you mean, daddy? I live in the house. Bitch. I got a court to, I had court today. I was hoping you called me yesterday so we can figure it out. Uh, <clears throat> I miss you, daddy. I miss you. I love you. Huh? I appreciate you. Oh, I appreciate you. Calling me. Huh? Okay, daddy. Baby, you haven't called me. I, I've been waiting for your call. Huh? Yes, daddy. What is wrong with you? Why is you calling me like this? Your baby call him daddy yet. I know my kids. I know that's some It's some jail talk. It wasn't even no good jail talk. Call my wife. We all heard you tell DDG that you would never marry a floozy that does all of them people in these streets. You would never marry her. You in jail. Just get a tattoo for us in jail. Hell, just claim the baby while you in jail. We'll take ownership. Just take ownership of the baby and then we'll believe some of this shit. But right now, it's giving another promotion for the circus. And it's just not giving. It's just a mess. It's a hot fucking mess. Like, I, I just, I don't, I, when it comes to my kids, I just already know. I could already see through the future of the lens that it's just going to be another disaster. Because she ain't going to want him to put Javon first. Knowing that he ain't going to put her first. With all them bodies she got on her. He, she already know John is not fixing to be for real. She already know this. And then she playing with us. And then later on when he don't, when he forget where he came from again. And then it's going to be, oh, you raised him. Your son ain't shit. She just going to have people out here talking some more shit that we don't want to hear. Because I don't care if you in jail or not. Don't tell no broad that you about to be her husband knowing that you ain't. You know good and damn well that woman is not about to let you be Javon's father because she ain't have a father, so she don't even know how to receive a man that's going to be a father. The Lord will rebuke all of this before he lets you think that it's okay to get with a woman that can't never be around your kids. I'm going to repeat myself. She's not going to be able to handle it. Her spirit is evil 